Now to a CBS 2 exclusive. We are hearing from the mother of a suspect shot by police in northern North Suburban Round Lake Beach. Now police were responding to a domestic violence call yesterday when they say the suspect lunged at officers with a sledgehammer. Our Saul Rezai is live this morning with the exclusive interview and the very latest on the investigation. Assal. Yeah, Ryan and Mugo police responding to a call of that man initially beating his mom and aunt with a sledgehammer and as they arrived on scene, things getting even more out of control. Take a look at this video. You can see the street where this happened in around Lake Beach blocked off for hours there. This is on the 2000 block of Redwood Drive there. That 911 call coming in around three o'clock in the afternoon. Officers on scene able to get the two victims, the mom and the aunt outside to an ambulance waiting nearby and police say the suspect still armed with the sledgehammer charged at officers multiple times. Officers first deploying a taser before shooting that suspect. He was taken to a hospital where he later died. His mother spoke with CBS 2. We won't show her because she was badly bleeding and injured. She says her son Brandon Barry was only 22 years old. He didn't know what was going on. He was sick. He was sick and they shot him. They knew better. They knew he was sick. So he was sorry. not a threat. He was not a threat to them. Police tell us that the suspect was known to police and that the home had a history of domestic related calls. They tell us the investigation continues this morning. I'm in the Streetside studio. I saw CBS 2 News.